This portion of Local Lifestyles is sponsored by the Hottie Shrine Circus. It certainly is, and the excitement is building for the annual Hottie Shrine Circus. This year, a local cheer team is adding the energy. Dale Thomas, of course, is the public relations director for the Shrine. He's here today with Sarah Baylor. From, she's the owner of Legacy Elite Cheer, yay team, and some talented <laughs> team members. This is Abigail and Isabel. Uh, get that right? Yes. Okay, yay me. So, <laughs> let's talk about tickets and times, and then we're going to get to the... The town. Well, as always, the 88th this year is going to open on Thanksgiving Day weekend. We open on Thanksgiving uh, Day at 5 o'clock, so you got plenty of time to eat some turkey, take a nap, and still come down. <laughs> uh, then we move into Friday and Saturday with shows at 9.30, 2 in the afternoon, and 7 at night. And our final performance is Sunday afternoon at 3 o'clock. There you go. There's all the info. If you see yep. a Shriner, yep. get your tickets. The best way to get them from a Shriner is you get a $4 discount on each ticket. So find a Shriner or come on down to the Shrine uh, building at uh, Riverside and Walnut. You'll see the big sign, Shrine to Ticket Office. You can purchase tickets there with that same discount. Well, I know Dale and I have been talking about what's coming up at the circus for a couple of weeks. And one of the things that interests me so much is that local aspect. And that's where Sarah comes in <laughs> and her dance team. So, Sarah, I know you're excited. We we are so excited. We are so excited. Um, it's it's a great opportunity for us. Our kids have competed in tons of different venues and everything, but we have never competed in a circus. And what little kids dream to be in the circus? So they are they are so pumped. Some of my little babies though still think they're going to ride the elephants and not do the well. Show. Okay, but. you might want to set that expectation. <laughs> I don't know. We, Maybe we, we got to switch that expectation around. But we are we are absolutely thrilled. We've been working on our different performances, so we're covering all three rings. So each ring will have. Some Something different. It's three, pretty much three different shows. So wow. um, it's going to be a lot of action-packed entertainment. They'll be uh, stunting. They will be jumping, tumbling, dancing, flipping. So we are excited to be here and put on an awesome show. Uh, well, we talked I'm, about a pyramid, but I wanted to be on top, and they said no. Well, you know, <laughs> can you all make that happen? We can make it happen, right, Abigail? Yeah, yeah. We can make it happen for sure. Uh, we just need a little more practice. So. Wrestling him down for his fans. <laughs> yeah. You know, there you go. <laughs> so let's talk about what it took to get here. Because because, you know, you don't just break out into dances. It's a lot of training, a lot of practice, lots of hours. It is. It's a lot of time, a lot of commitment for our athletes. So our athletes, um, they come in in May. That's when we typically do our uh, team evaluations. And they train. They train from May all the way to the beginning of the fall with learning skills, learning um, jumps, learning dances, learning tumbling. And then in the fall, through the early spring, we start competing. Um, so they actually just competed last weekend at a major national. We did phenomenal. Um, we were recognized for a lot of different things. Um, our older team got first place grand champion. Yay! Yes, which is awesome. Um, they also were uh, awarded best pyramid, um, <laughs> so which was really awesome. It was just a cool thing to give. Our junior team, our junior rough riders, they got second. Our regulators, which is our youth team, got second. And then our mini reckless came home with first. And then Legacy is always known to have the best and most exciting fans, um, so which they will be in the crowd for the circus yelling and cheering. So they won best fans over the weekend. Oh, so yeah, I didn't even know it, that was yeah, something you yeah, Oh, that's a, a very cool thing. So, um, yeah, so we just, we train. And like I said, we're so excited that, you know, the Hottie Shrine found us and asked us to come and be a part of the show. It's so a big excited. honor. It really, oh, it really is. And I'm is. so excited yes. for all of you and for all the families who will be involved. So get out there and show them what you got, girls. I know you <laughs> will. You can see these and more talented young people at the Hottie Shrine Circus. That's the local connection. Thank you, Dale. Thank you. Thank all. you. Thank you. We'll be back with more local lifestyles. <laughs> around. There you go. Yay. This portion of Local Lifestyles is sponsored by the Hottie Shrine Circus.